Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you're new here, my name is Esther Moffrey. In today's video, I want to show you the power of alignment, time frame alignment. And in this case, you need all the four time frames alignment so that you can be comfortable when to hold. Guys, you need to understand that in every trader, every trader, you need to know five things. Number one, when to buy, when, when to buy. Number two, when to sell, when to sell. Number three, when to hold. Number four, when to exit. Number five, number five is when to avoid. When to avoid. Guys, if you're watching this and you don't, you're not confident with the five things, I guess this is where you need to start. So you need to know when do I buy the market? When do I sell? When to hold? When to exit? When to avoid? Today we are speaking about when to hold. When do you hold? Or how do you think swing traders, they are very confident when it comes to their, uh, their analysis. What makes a swing trader very confident that they can hold a market one week, two weeks, three weeks, one month, two months, a year? What makes these people hold the market? So if you're interested to know how to hold, how to, to, to know when to hold, continue watching. So guys, I'll give you a good example with uh, Euro JPY. I'll give you an example with Euro JPY. And I believe after this video, you will have learned so many things. I believe you will have learned so many things. So let's get into the video. So Euro JPY will start with the monthly. Number one thing, if you want to know when to hold, of course, you need time frame alignment. So when to hold is as a result of when to hold equals equals for time frames al alignment, time frame alignment. So when to hold equals four time frames align, alignment. So, and in this case, the time frames that we have, of course, it's monthly, and then we have weekly, and then we have daily, and then we have four hour. So you need to understand that if at all I want to come and hold in a certain market, I need to know my time frame alignment. And my uh, and something I've come to observe is that you might hold the market that has already given a confirmation using monthly time frame. Yes, it has not aligned on weekly, daily, four hour. There is no alignment on weekly, daily, four hour. Still, you are qualified to hold, guys. I hope that point you have got it clearly. If you find that on weekly, on monthly, sorry, if you find that on monthly there's a confirmation, but the confirmation is not yet on weekly, daily, four hour, you can enter one position as you hold, waiting for weekly, daily, and four hour to align. But guys, you cannot do vice versa. There's no way you can find a setup on four hour. You have not checked daily. Daily has not aligned. Weekly has not aligned, monthly has not aligned, and then you think of holding. That is the take home. So you can enter, you can find a, a market or a structure on monthly, and you can say maybe this is a double top, a confirmed double top. I can maybe get in with one position, you see? So at the end of the day, I will sell as I wait for the three time frames to align. So in this case, Euro JPY, what do we have on Euro JPY? You can see we have a possible double double top. You can see how we have that possible double top. This is monthly, guys. We have a possible double top on monthly. So in this case, we just need to be sure is a cell confirmed because double tops gives us a cell confirmation. So possible double top. So do we have a confirmation on this double top? Guys, if you need a confirmation, I use WBB strategy. So that's my double top. This is my neckline, guys. So that's my neckline. And then we have to know the half. 
you have to know the half. So that is the half gaze. You can see, I just need to know, do I have an alignment or confirmation? Alignment first, it is not of question at this moment. The only thing I need to know, do I have a confirmation? Anytime you're trading double top, anytime you're trading double bottom, you use WBP. So we wait for the red candle and this red candle is not an angle. So what do you do? You place a box like that. And then we waited for another month and on December, the market broke that box, giving us a WBB confirmation. So from monthly perspective, from monthly perspective, Euro JPY is a strong sell. It is going to sell how many pips? It's going to sell how many pips? 974. Uh, 74. So anyone who is a swing trader from the banks, from institute, from retail traders with big account, already they are in a sell position on Euro JPY. Now, if at all you want to be a swing trader and you don't have a lot of capital or you are preservative, you just want to be given with a discounted price, that's when alignment comes in place. Because yes, monthly can give us a sell, but it can take another three months before this sell goes down. So the market, you can never predict how long the market can go to TP because take profit is here. So we cannot dictate. It will take one week, one month, one year. This market can take a whole year. I'm very curious to know because today is Jan, January. And how long will it take for this double top to be respected? Will it take one month? I'm very, very curious to know. And once I get the data, I'll come back with this video and show you guys. So on monthly, we have the alignment, but uh, we have the confirmation of a sale. But now what we need for those people with small accounts, and that's why I say, if you want to hold, Euro JPO is on a sale. There's no doubt about it. If you want to get in right at this moment, it is on a sale. There's no uh, doubt about it. But alignment is what makes many people doubt the analysis. So, and, and that's where you now you go to weekly. If I go to weekly, I don't have the same double top that I'm seeing. There's none, there's no double top. Like go and check clearly. The double top is not even visible. Like it, it was not visible because if I put my line there, you can see clearly my, the market never touched. So on weekly, we don't have any double, double top. What do we have on weekly guys? So let me remove this box and remove this. And now we want to know, what is happening on weekly? What do we have on weekly? Guys, if you can spot a double bottom, a possible double bottom, can you spot it? So on weekly, weekly does not care about double top. And this is a different house. We have moved from monthly. Monthly, it is a sell, period. If you want to enter hold, and it can take you so much drawdown, but monthly they have declared it is a sell. But when it comes to uh, Euro JPY weekly, we can't see that same double top, but we can see a possible double bottom. And in this case, this double bottom, this double bottom, uh, uh, we can just measure half. We have our half there and we have our neckline. And you can see it's clearly, it's evident that the half has been tested so many times. You can see the first week, then the market dropped, the second week, the market is now dropping. Like the half has been tested so many times, like for three, four weeks, the market has been tested there. But we cannot say this market will sell. What if you sell immediately? And then as you observe, the market breaks the half. What can you do? If now you sell according to monthly, but weekly we have a possible double bottom and eventually the market break half, the market will continue to go to the neckline maybe to make a double top on weekly. So at the end of the day, when to hold, you need the four alignment. Because if you're, if you're worrying of a drawdown of 944 pips, if your account can't hold 944 pips, you better wait for the four alignment. And this is what makes many people don't understand because you need the four alignments for your account to be safe. But for those people with big account, already you're JPY, they are sell because from monthly perspective, 
it is a sell and that's what makes different like the swing traders they just check monthly and they get in so in this case we have a double bottom we have a possible double bottom here so let's let me write it for you so that you can see we have a possible double bottom so we have that possible double bottom and then and then we have um we have the neckline over there so we have the neckline and the half so when you want to enter sell on 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 euro jpy according to weekly time frame you need to ask yourself am i supported by weekly is weekly aligning i hope this video will help you because many people do this mistake so that's our half guys so unless the market and and if you have a possible double bottom how do you want the market to align with monthly it's very simple we would want to see a failed double bottom if we get a failed double bottom guys do you, what do you think failed double bottom gives it gives an inverted cap and handle so if we get a failed double bottom we'll get an inverted cap and handle so what we are looking at we are looking at something like this we are looking at something where the sellers will be so powerful they break that double bottom you see when sellers now break this double bottom what we'll have will have an inverted head cap and handle and the distance we can draw this is the distance that you want the market to drop to so that's the distance and then we bring this distance around there so if we we even we measure half we measure half so our target our first target will be there so that's our first target and this is what we want to see on weekly a fail double top a fail double bottom sorry and we want to see this double bottom like we want alignment if you at all we have to enter on your jpy so unless we get alignment it's nothing we are doing and then if you flip on daily we still have the same double bottom and guys i told you if you ever have the same double bottom on different time frames of course we don't want breaking on daily because if we get a break on daily by the time weekly weekly is confirming we get maybe a week or something it won't be valid but we want this candle not to be on daily but to be on weekly and because they have the same pattern our eyes are on them so the second thing that i want to see from this market is to see a candle breaking that double bottom so guys if you're watching me i don't want to take much of your time Euro JPY is a good pair to see and to watch and to know and to understand how alignment happens. So this should be in your watch list. You should watch it every week. Come, come back, come back. Now what you're watching is, will they break here? Will they break and violate that double bottom? Or will they break half and give us an indication that the market is about to go up before it comes down? If you want to sell according to monthly, be ready to be taken a draw a drawdown of more than a thousand pips. Are you ready? Because if you put zero zero one, that's like negative a hundred dollars. If you're ready, because I have to prepare you. Swing trading, you have to know what if the market retraces, how far will it retrace? So, guys, alignment of time frames gives you the power to hold. So, if you have been asking your question. How do I become a swing trader? All you need is alignment. And the best alignment, guys, I'll do another video on this. The best two alignments that you ever need in your trading journey is monthly and weekly. Daily, you can deal with it. Four, you can deal with it. But monthly and weekly, if they have aligned, you're good to go. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Love you so much. Until next time. Bye-bye. Love you.